Okay. Again, welcome, family. My name is David Jawara. Uh, I have been working with Africa for the Africans since 2006, organizing business and investment conference. Um, this is our first, and we're happy to say, um, not the last, um, citizenship workshop. Okay? Citizenship workshop, because now the doors of not only Ghana, but Africa is opening so that you can get your citizenship and enjoy the freedom of moving around this continent without being called a foreigner, without being um, uh, just harassed in many areas. Uh, I call it harassment because you can't do much in terms of business if you're not, um, if you don't have your paperwork proper, okay? One quick example. You need almost a million dollars to get your business started here if you don't become a, a Ghanaian. With the Ghanaian Parliament, you would need $500,000. Back in the day, it was 10000 for me, but that has changed tremendously. So just want to give you one quick example. Uh, I want to thank Brother Bumani for doing tremendous work in bringing our people home. He's doing the work that Marcus Garvey would be proud of him. Very proud of him. Let's give him a round of applause. <laughs> the rain of shine. He's on time with his uh, bringing our people home. So I thank you for uh, coming with him on this particular group. Also, our beloved Dr. Milana. Uh, I met him in the early 90s here in Ghana. I have been blessed to see him grow and he was very instrumental in helping us to break the ice in getting citizenship in Ghana. And we, I owe my citizenship to Dr. Milana. Let's give him a round of applause. So we like to introduce ourselves. So I would like to um, just start over here. You can just introduce yourself quickly. Okay, we can start. Well, we can start here and then. Yeah, let me, uh, let me introduce uh, my secretary okay. and assistants here. And you can just tell them that her name is uh, Patience Rosie. Would you please introduce yourself? I'm Patience Rosie. Um, I'm the secretary to Dr. Helping him with. Speak a little louder, please. I'm helping him with the citizenship application and the uh, membership forms, helping him to enter in it and prepare it so we can, um, we can be able to process it for the citizenship to be done. Brother Isaac, he works with our organization as one of the IT, you know what I mean, IT representative, Brother Isaac. Okay. I'm Isaac Bano. I am Dr. Malanes, IT technician. I help him with his uh, computers and then fixing of his laptop. Very good. You're welcome. This this is my good brother from Tanzania, by way of um, Virgin Islands. He's currently um, uh, with me in Ghana, and um, so I'd like him to introduce himself. Hey, greetings, my name is Tamidia. I'm originally from the Virgin Islands, and I repatriated to East Africa, Tanzania. I married a Tanzanian, and we have three children. We, I built a house over there. You know, we're doing some farming. We dug a couple of wells. And things are blessed, you know, things are super blessed. So it's a great opportunity, you know, to be here now in West Africa where citizenship is being given. This is something that we definitely need to take advantage of, especially at this time in the earth where we see nations collapsing. You know, we need to be in position. So count yourself blessed to be here. You know, take advantage of the information that's going to be given and move aggressively with what you're going to be given. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very good. Okay, next one. Excuse my sadness. My name is Kim Curry Goldsby. Oh. I'm from a suburb of Los Angeles, California called Riverside. And I'm here with my daughter, Jasmine Curry. And I'm one of the members of the Black Star community. Um, I'm not going to totally repatriate, but I am hoping to build a home in the community. Anyone? Anyone else? 
free to introduce yourself. We want to. Oh, hi. My name is Agnes Boxley. from Brooklyn. Welcome. All right. Good evening. My name is Shelley Matthews. I'm originally from Ohio in the U.S. and currently living in Oregon and trying to figure this out. I don't know if it will be full repatriation, but I know that a lot of my life will be spent on this continent. My name is Eric Ando and I'm Michelle's assistant. Okay, very good. My name is Asar Amin-Ra from Detroit, Michigan. Looking to repatriate within four years. Yes, yes. Okay, my name is Charles Justin. I'm from North New Jersey. I'm most interested in uh, the population. Uh, yes, my name is Betsy Forbes. I'm from Toronto, Canada. I'm Jamaican, born there, then I went to Canada. Now I'm trying how to repatriate back to my motherland. So this is why um, I would like to learn as much as possible how to make it smooth for me to repatriate. Good night. My name is Monique Milton. I live in New York, uh, Jamaican background. I'm here to definitely learn to see what I can do to try to make sure it's this country. Jeremy from Portland, Oregon. Great. Okay. I'm Felicia from Arkansas. Oh, great. Right. So, what's this? My name is Jasmine Curry. Um, that's my mother right there. And I don't know about vision or anything like that because I'm still learning about it. But I do plan on uh, returning. Yes, my name is. Oh. My name is Joyce. I'm a designer. Okay. Yeah. Yes, my name is Noel, originally from Jamaica, living in the United States, and I would like to repatriate. Great. Very good. So definitely um, you got Two great days lined up um, in terms of a lot of information that will be given to you. Um, I always call Brother Bumani up uh, to personally allow him to say a few words. Bumani, you like to come or are you willing to do all that tomorrow? I can come and say a few things. Okay, come on, Bumani. Let's give our brother. Eric uh, Green's family, uh, this is uh, one of those foundations of uh, us building true citizenship in Africa. So the best people to learn from is our people that have put the work in on the ground. And uh, Dr. Milana, I've been communicating with him for, I want to say at least a good 14 years, from, before two, from 2006 or before that. Right. And uh, he's <laughs> been a man on a mission. And I'm just proud to say that, uh, you know, it's good to see that uh, we can share this good news that we have a nice way, uh, organized way for us to become citizens. And Ghana is going to literally just pave the way for other countries to come. And Ghana has been and is paving the way. So family, uh, this is just us sharing what we can share with you to help that process. And, and you know, it would be selfish if we just didn't keep on doing this work and keep right. on this, keep us moving forward. And we see, like, right now is a great time to get more of our brothers and sisters in America and other parts of the African diaspora interested in making moves to Africa. You know, you have to strike while the iron is hot and you have those two wicked devils battling for who's going to be the next uh, you know, oppressor of our people and it's given our folks, you know, opening their minds up a little bit more and then while those things are going on, we just got to share this information so we've been documenting everything. So even later on, if you want to share any experience or anything, share it as best as possible and let's do this. And so, fam, this is Bomani Tamba, and appreciate everybody, our energy, and uh, we're going to keep it strong. And appreciate Great. it. Very good. Okay, so we're going to move right into the program, this workshop on citizenship. Um, again, my name is Brother David. Um, we organize these workshops to make sure that you are given your birthright. Um, 